I bet you've never heard of an aquarium related board game. You know why I would bet that? Cause neither have I. And I've been in the aquarium game for a while now. This board game is called Freshwater Tank, the game of fish compatibility. And let me tell you right off the bat, I love it. Now while this video is sponsored by Kaplan Crypto, the makers of the board game, and I thank them for reaching out to me to get this to you guys, you guys know that on this channel, I would never recommend a product that I don't use myself. Well, this game is something I definitely plan to use. When Omar from Kaplan Crypto reached out to me and asked if I would test his game and do a video review, I said, a game? <laughs> Send it over. My family and I are all board game lovers, and those of you that are too, know what it's like to try a brand new game with the family. When we received it and cracked open the shipping box and took one look at the game itself, when my kids saw the box, it was instantly game night. All of a sudden, iPads went flying, Xbox controllers went tumbling, it was game night. First thing I noticed is the quality of the game materials. This isn't some rinky dink game with crusty cardboard and runny blotchy ink. The quality is outstanding. It's as good as the biggest board games you've ever played. Yeah, I'm talking Monopoly quality. After setting up and reading the rules, I realized again, this wasn't just thrown together just to make a quick buck. There was a lot of thought and foresight put into this. The game is designed to educate about fish and how compatible they are with other fish that you may want or already have in your tank. But while you're being educated, the element of fun a board game is supposed to have is there as well. This is gonna help more fish keepers and young future fish keepers understand more about the hobby. The goal of the game is to fill your tank with 10 compatible fish. First one there wins the game. Each fish card has information on that specific fish, including how peaceful or how aggressive it is. And let me tell you, when you pull a fish card of a fish that you already have in your tank, I mean, you know, your real life tank, it's super cool knowing that your fish are included in the game, even though there's tons of fish included in the game. By using the enclosed compatibility chart, you can confirm which fish can successfully live with each other. But if you prefer, you don't have to get too technical because the game has difficulty levels. Different ways to play from novice to expert level. Makes it perfect for beginners to learn and for veterans to test their knowledge. As you travel around the board, you can land on a fish tile or an incident tile, which allows you to pick up the corresponding cards. My kids loved pulling a fish card and getting a fish they've never seen before. They read the information on the card and decided whether they could keep that fish in their tank with the other fish that were already in there. Incident cards are super cool too, because they have positive and negative incidents. Like, you found a treasure chest, pick up two fish cards. Or, lucky you, take any fish from anyone else's tank. Yeah, I had to give up my own fish so nobody got salty. But then there's also cards like, oh no, you've gotten a piranha, all your fish get eaten. So be careful out there, guys. Now, as hard as the game has tried to be as accurate as possible, it states right in the rules to remember it's still just a game and some of the fish that the game says would work well together, in reality, might not. Plus, we all know that with any given species, you can have an angel and you can have a total butthead. <laughs> so keep that in mind as you play the game. Overall though, I can honestly say my wife, kids, and I totally love the game. We've already played twice since receiving it, and I get asked about once a day when we're gonna play again. So if you're into board games and you're obviously into fish keeping, right? Check this game out. You can purchase the game on Amazon. There aren't very many left, so I suggest you jump on it right away. The link is gonna be in the description. And do me a favor, once you get the game, leave me a comment below. I wanna know exactly how much fun you had. I believe this game is just another way to spread the joy that we all have for the hobby to others. If you like this video, here's two more I'm sure you're gonna love, and I'll see you on the other side. Peace.